Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video I will be showing some of my favorite outfits Jenny has ever wore. There are definitely more outfits that I'm obsessed with other than the ones I'm showing here, so if you want a part 2, let me know in the comment section down below. Let's get with it. This outfit is from one of Jenny's solo stages with SBS. And I think I'm obsessed. This is like hands down one of the best outfits Jenny have ever worn, even though it was in 2018, and you can fight me how much as you'd like, but I'm not going to ever say otherwise. It's so elegant, pretty and the black and silver really matches Jenny's aura. Black is definitely Jenny's color along with red. Jenny always had that elegant royalty vibe, but this outfit amplifies it 10,000x and I mean that in a good way. I do see why though the stylists aren't letting her wear these types of outfits anymore, they're more for solo concerts, and even if the other girls wore those same type of styles, I don't think it would really match the concept Blackpink's going for. But to be honest, I'm not exactly sure what I like best. Every detail contributes. Like the hair clips, the gloves, the bodice, that trailing dress. It's just perfection and I'm not hearing otherwise. This next outfit is from the 2018 Soul Tour. I'm honestly starting to think 2018 was the best year outfit wise for Jenny. This outfit is only one of the many examples from what I know, a lot of people don't really talk about this outfit that much which is upsetting to me but I guess we all have different tastes. This outfit is a bit simple but the simplicity yet the tiny details is what I think really makes the cut for me. I think the biggest reason I like this outfit is because of the pink silver color scheme and because of the crop top with the jacket. I think it really suits her and brings out her girly chic side out. I hope we get more outfits like these in the future. This outfit is honestly so wholesome. I love it so freaking much. And it isn't just because of the outfit, it's because of the savagery behind it. If you didn't know, some people had a problem with Jenny's nurse outfit in the Lovesick Girls music video and even led to YG having to censor that part out of the video. And guess what? The day with the pretty savage performance after, Jenny wore perfection. I mean look at the pants censored. If that doesn't scream savage I don't know what does. Okay now about the outfit, I really like that gold choker and the crop top really goes well with the jeans. And those long gloves look so cool. And it goes well with Taesong, pretty savage, because she's being pretty and savage at the same time. The girl can sing, rap and dance. She can songwrite. She can produce. She knows the struggles every idol faces considering how she's under the most problematic company ever. Just start your own entertainment. I mean look at this outfit. Such business vibes. As soon as I looked at this picture, I instantly thought about CEO Jenny and Jen Entertainment. Okay but seriously, this outfit is perfection. It isn't just because of the jewelry, but also because of the blazer itself. I really like the blazer, is that what it's called? and the golden jewelry and buckle really add an element to the outfit. Plus the boots. Look at the boots. Yeah I need to stop now, I've been saying the same thing over and over, and I'm sure nobody wants to hear that. What type of video would this be if I didn't include this particular outfit? I mean, this is literally one of Jenny's most ever iconic outfits ever ever. And it was in 2017. Honestly, we need more outfits like these now. There is a reason why Jenny's called, Human Chanel in this outfit perfectly portrayed why. From the Chanel lace crop top to the black skirt, everything screams, Queen, Chanel, and, you're all broke, we all stan. No seriously, the black crop top really goes well with the skirt and it all fits. I wouldn't be surprised if they actually were sold together, or maybe it's just the magic of Jenny. Either way, I think the thing that makes the outfit one of the best for me is the crop top in the floral pattern netted, it really completes the full regal Victorian vibe. <laughs> Jenny's Weekend 2 Coachella outfit is, that outfit. It's simple but it still stood out the most to me, and it is definitely my favorite outfit she wore. 
The outfit's simple, it's just this really pretty crop top and a skirt, I think it's the way Jenny wore it that makes it as iconic as it is. Jenny was having so much fun in Coachella, she was so pumped up and full of energy, she was smiling the full time and it was her best stage presence performance. The way she just carried the outfit is what makes this better than what it is. Coachella Jenny could even make a dishrag look good. But the outfit though is worth talking about and I'm not going to excuse some of the credit the outfit gives, everything matches. The stylists did an amazing job, from the crop top with the white silver designs to the white silver skirt, the stylists know what they were doing. The scheme, the design, they knew what would complete Jenny's full out presence and look. This is from their private stage in Seoul. So remember this fan cam? This one, the one taken from the amazing paint it black. I think this is Jenny's most used fan cam. We all freaked out as we should, because it's Jenny and painted blacks doing god work. The case with this outfit is the same as Coachella outfit I just mentioned. The outfit's simple, but it's the way Jenny carries and fits the outfit that makes it as iconic and memorable as it is. It's just a white crop top with a lace bow and a blue skirt, but Jenny really looks magnificent and starry in it. Please don't be offended, but in my opinion, only Jenny could have made this iconic. The outfit was made for her and the stylists knew that. Honestly, in the future when I become an adult or something, I could see myself buying the skirt, not the crop top because I don't like wearing them in general I feel exposed, if it was affordable for me. Remember this red dress? This fan cam? When Jenny walked down the stage like a bad bee with all the cameras flashing at her and she sended all her haters and fans to oblivion? Well, I sure do, and I sure you do as well. This is one of Jenny's most iconic outfits and performances, I still can't believe she doesn't like wearing red because she looks flawless in it. Again, I'm starting to believe it's really Jenny carrying the outfit, the outfit wears her, it's her that's making these outfits so memorable. I mean, yes, this dress is really pretty itself, it's red, and the dress actually matches solo, with the bow top and the red trail, the black boots, and the choker, you get the idea, but the way Jenny carried and performed in this outfit plus her signature walk, is what really makes this outfit as memorable as it is. And out of topic, look at how many views this fan cam has, 13m like wow. I hope you liked this video, if you did make sure to subscribe and click the like button for more videos like this. Bye.